Hey everyone, welcome back to the long dark. We're here in the Mystery Lake camp office, starting episode number four. Um, if you remember from the last episode, we went ahead and came over from Trapper's Cabin. Um, it was a fairly peaceful walk. Didn't really encounter too much. Didn't see any wolves, so that's going to be have to. Um, that's going to be something we're going to have to note, rather, if I can get my words right today. <laughs> um, but we're ultimately going to try to make it to the dam. Um, so we'll see how that goes. We have our teas cooking by the fire. Got 20 minutes left on it. What time of day is it? Just to orient ourselves. Just around noontime. Okay. Well, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and just check out the weather outside. Let's see if it's frightful or not. Uh, hey, actually, that's... This is really good weather. I really think we should move in this. Um, so I've actually been thinking about where we want to go. Ultimately, the dam is going to be our, you know, final destination. But I really think we should start pushing for the, the um, the cabins across the lake. Um, they can usually have food in them sometimes, and food is what we want to stockpile. So I think we're going to go ahead and head for those. Um, it can't really hurt, right? Having more food, it can't hurt us at all. It just benefits. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take a torch. We're going to go ahead and take our teas we're gonna take everything that's carrying and we're just gonna head off see what happens um we shouldn't have anything yet nothing on us so we're fine in that department let's go ahead and go oh yeah such a nice day you really just can't get better than this 22 degrees awesome looking good so we're gonna hit the fishing huts uh like you would usually if you're on the lake Fishing huts are pretty underrated, I feel. I feel like they uh, they can have some really good stuff in them when you're least expecting it, so. Hoping for a heavy hammer, you know? Even though it's heavy, it would still really greatly benefit us, definitely, um, to have that. Now, we, we really, if we get it, we don't have to worry about it when we go into Coastal Highway or Desolation Point. Um, so, bottom line, we're going to want to find a heavy hammer sooner rather than later, even if it is heavy. And we have to carry it across a region. That's fine. I just want to find it, you know. That's the hardest part. So, I do hear wolves. I am inclined to think they're over there. Um, more towards where the rabbits are and stuff. We're going to be going over there soon. Um, I just want to do the, the mystery lake tour, if you will. Um, we'll hit both of the fishing huts and we'll hit the two cabins across the way. We'll hit the two cabins over there and then the bear cabin. I like to call it. Um, and yeah, I would say big ticket items are definitely bedroll and food for sure. Hey, a flare. That's not bad. Got a lot of stuff in here. Not bad. Whoops. Nothing in there. Oh, we just searched that one already. All right. Yeah. All uh, all loose items. Nothing in the, in the loot containers. All right, we'll push on. A part of me seems like it's going to clear up soon. And that isn't necessarily a great thing. Yeah, they're the wolves over there. Okay. Interesting. Well, we're just going to continue on, but as I was saying, if it gets clear, that's not really a great thing because usually when it's clear, the wind starts to kick up. Wow, nothing in this fishing hut. Oops. But yeah, when the wind starts to kick up, it's not great. You know, we're going to lose our torch, definitely. Let's go ahead and throw that down and replace. How many torches do we have? Eh. Okay. Not a ton. Definitely not a ton. But we'll keep moving. Maybe we'll get lucky and find a torch. I, I doubt that very highly, but it's possible. You tend to find torches when you really least expect it. You know? Like, oh, 100% torch. No way. Don't really need it, but... but all right. Um, I don't think I see the bear unless that's... Nope, that's a wolf. Okay. That's another wolf. And no bear, so... I don't know what the deal is there. I don't have a problem. Usually this bear over here is pretty, uh... Pretty chilled out. Easy to get around. You can just duck into these cabins if he's chasing you. Or the fishing huts, too. That works. Alright, we're at the lake cabins now. Uh, this spot is usually safe. It's a little hairy sometimes because there can be a wolf 
um, in that direction there. So we do want to be a little careful of that. But otherwise, it's usually a good spot. Oh, nice, guys. Matches. So it was worth coming over here. <laughs> it was definitely worth it. Good. So now we have another 12 chances at life, basically. That's good. And that was the only thing in here, I think. Wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. Not even like a sardines or anything. Wow. All right. Well, can't say I'm mad about that. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty pretty happy. Uh, we're going to be overweight pretty soon. Eh, actually, no, we're not. We got the food bonus going, which I kind of forgot about. Um, so that's good. That'll make us carry more uh, fire starters, basically. I really just consider books as fire starters. I mean, it's... They're so good, you know? So good. I uh, will leave it. Any food? What I'm here for. No. Unfortunate. Oof. Yeah, food's a hot ticket. It's a hot item. And it looks like we're not going to get it in here, so let's keep moving on. We do have another house to search, I believe. Nope. Burnt down. Okay. Cool. Oh. Got a little, uh... Where is he? I don't even know where he is. He's got to be over here somewhere. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, interesting. I didn't see him when I was doing my initial check before we went into the cabin, but I guess that's fine. We'll we'll let him uh, we'll let him come for the ride. I guess. I really want these cattails, but I really also don't want him to get close. So we'll take that. This is how Dead Man Runs end right here. All right, all right, calm down. You're okay. You're okay, we're okay, we're all okay, right? For the most part. Hopefully everyone's okay. Yeah, hopefully you're doing okay out there. Hopefully you're doing better than this character right here. Um, okay, it looks like that was probably the one wolf that was patrolling this area. So, I think I'm just going to run it in. I'm doing okay on energy. Don't have to worry about it right now. All right, he should be far enough away to reset. I'm going to grab all the books still. Uh, nothing between the chair or under the chair. Medicine shelf. Yeah, nothing. Um, trash can. Yeah, nothing too. Oh, how's our clo clothing in a situation? It's not great. It's really not great. Uh, that's unfortunate. But it is what it is. Uh, okay, that wolf is going to be out there. So... Let's take a let's take a gamble. Run to this one here. Ooh, that made me jump. All right, we're good. We're fine. All right. So now, unfortunately, we are kind of pinned in here, um, which is a little too bad. Um, I definitely do want to keep the torches going, but I'm not going to keep it going for another hour because i think i are gonna sleep an hour at least try to i want to get to alan's cave somewhat soon and i don't need that wolf trailing me uh, maybe we can i don't know this is kind of kind of big brain if we can pull this off but let's go ahead and try it uh, i'm gonna do that i'm gonna go ahead and harvest this for 15 minutes let the wolf uh, reset what are we at now with the torch okay that's another 15 minutes we could do Cool. Nice. All right. Torch is still going. I'm going to pick that up. We can harvest it in a minute. Yeah, the rest of the food's pretty sketchy, you know? You hate to see it. You really hate to see it. That's why we need food now, you know? We need food now. Do we have a hacksaw? We do have a hacksaw. All right. Well, that's good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and throw that down. I'm going to use our 43% torch. It's our last torch as well, so we do have to make this one count. Um, drink some of the water. Don't want to drink it all. All right, let's go out and see if there's a wolf. Wow. Um, talk about not ideal travel weather. Um, okay. That's okay. We'll go ahead and make that work. We'll make this work. Um, just trying to survey the surroundings, if you will. Yeah, so let's go ahead and put a fire maybe right here. Looks somewhat protected, right? Yeah, it looks like it could it could be sheltered from a few sides. 
if wind were to kick in, which I have a feeling it's going to. Um, but we're going to make this fire real quick. I see some sticks up uh, up on the top left there we can go grab. But ultimately, I just do want to um, put some teas on the fire, make us nice and warm. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. The herbal down. We can even put the coffee down as well. Yeah, probably a good idea. And I'm going to go ahead and make some water too. Just 15 minutes worth. Nothing too much. I don't want to be carrying a ton of water with us. Same with books. Let's just chuck, uh, chuck both of those on. Hmm. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking we could probably make it to the other cabin. In relative peace, I don't think we'll get into really any trouble just going to the other cabin, you know? It's pretty close. Go ahead and just light a torch anyway, though. Just for protection while picking these sticks up. He's definitely out there. I just don't hear him. Oh, look at all these sticks, guys. Gotta be careful. Pick that one up, and we'll get this one. Go ahead and grab uh, the one over here. Oh, there he is, right there. Yeah, look at him in the trees. That's crazy. That's a... Uh... Yeah, that's quite a sneaky one there, so... I'm gonna break out this crouch walk. You'll, you'll be seeing this a lot. Um, I think I can get a quick, uh... Alright, there we go. I knew a little risky. I had to stand up there. Alright. Put that out. Cool. Alright. 13 minutes till boiled. Both of those are hot. Looking good. Both till boiled. Cool. Uh, anything we can prepare? No, it doesn't look like it. Any tinder we can do? Yeah, let's do 10 minutes. Cool. All right, that's good, that's good. I'm going to take both of these back. We don't really need any more water. Um, 33 minutes there. Go ahead and do that. Now, what could be a little risky is maybe going into sleep an hour. That could be a little risky. Um, so I don't know if I want to take that risk, necessarily. So let's go ahead and pull... We're probably only going to be able to pull two torches off of this. Yeah. A little unfortunate. Let's go ahead and just stoke it a little bit, and we'll pull some more off. Um, put a cedar on. Seems like overkill, but cedars are heavy. And we do have a lot of coal, too, in case we need it. So that's really good. We love to see that. That out. All right, we can take three more off. So there's the third one, and then this one, and we can do one more. Hey, look at fog's clearing up. Cool. All right. Okay, yeah, let's go. I prefer not to get noticed by anything, but if we do, you know, it is what it is. Um, I'd also love cattails over here as well. Cattails would be amazing. Something tells me though we might not get that. Yeah, there's the wolf right there. He was, he was checking us out. Definitely, we just couldn't see because it was foggy. All right. Um, this seems like a little overkill as well. They're pretty far away, but. I don't want to take the chance, basically. Actually, we'll, we'll be alright. Okay. Alright, well, I think the plan of action is going to go to that fishing hut, and then we'll maybe try to scale up the side of the hill and head over to the two trailers um, outside the dam. I think that's a pretty good call. I don't want to get too close to them, so that fishing hut looks a lot closer or a lot farther away rather than that one does. That's good. I'll go ahead and, and loot this house, though, real quick. Um, yeah, do that. Okay, um, take all the books again. Like a tradition, right? Uh, nothing in there, probably nothing in there. And probably nothing in here, either. I'm just so good, huh? That you just know after playing Dead Man for a day. <laughs> you just know. All right, let's get out here. Hopefully no bear spawns in. That would be not cool. All right. Uh, they seem far enough away where we can slide over here safely. 
Yeah, we're good. All right. Now this is this is the challenging part, and I speak from experience here. Um, this is, it's you know, in theory, right? It, it is easy. All you got to do is just make it to the dam, right? That's true. That is true. But this is where the like, game likes to screw you. Like right here, you see the cattails moving. It likes to get windy when you have a torch on you. And why I like carrying a torch over to the dam is because outside the dam, between the two trailers, there is a wolf that likes to spawn. And actually, there can be two wolves, which I found out on my last dead man run off camera that I did. Um, but yeah, without a torch, I mean, and it's nighttime. Mm, it was the exact situation that we're in right now, basically. Um, so hopefully it goes a little better this time. Uh, sprain risk, okay. Gonna want to take care of that pretty soon. Cloth, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and drink that. Give us a little calorie back. Um, we'll eat three cattails. I'm just kind of hoping we find some food in the trailers. We just need enough food for tonight. That's all we need. And then once daytime again comes around, we can go ahead and sleep in the dam. All right, let's move uh, this way. I don't know if you can get up that way, uh, and I'm not going to try either. I'm just going to try the routes that we know, or that I know. This is not the run to go off the beaten path. Um, I guess in theory we should be okay just by standing up and moving, but... Is he moving towards or away? I think he's moving towards. All right, now he's moving to the side. Oop, drop the torch. Drop it now. Oh my gosh, 1% on that torch. That was way too close. Um, I gotta get better at that. That was way too close, and I was gonna cry so much if we lost that torch. That would have been super sad. Alright, we're good. Let's just crawl up here. We're okay. Alright. So we're just gonna follow this ridge. Um, we're gonna head into the Allen Cave area. Sometimes there's even a deer carcass that you can harvest, and I think we're gonna do that. I think we'll take Mother Nature up on that bet if uh, the carcass is there. We'll get a little food in us. We'll go ahead and check out the hunting blind as well. Um, I remember from my interloper runs that I used to do, there would usually be a bedroll there. It's a bedroll spawn anyway. I'm not sure if they changed that. So we'll have to uh, we'll have to see here. We'll have to see if there's any wolves down here as well. There's no wolves down here. They're usually over at the hunting blind. They're just kind of camping out. But if you're smart, you can avoid them. Uh, those are the wolves over there, so no need to panic yet, anyway. There we go. Underweight now. All we had to do is lose a torch. All right. So if we do get a wolf spawning over here and... um. You know, and it's guarding the deer carcass. I think I'm just going to pass on it. You know, I don't really think it's worth it to try to risk ourselves and um, just get a few pieces of meat. It's a little, mm, a little debatable. Not trying to die the first few episodes, you know? I do hear a wolf. And is that snow I saw on my screen? I really hope it isn't. No, it wasn't. Okay, good. I'm hearing a wolf. I have a feeling it's in here. Yep, right there. And there is a deer carcass too. Yikes. Okay. All right, well, let's go ahead and play our cards smartly. I unfortunately don't think we're going to be taking the deer carcass. Um, I just don't like harvesting things when a wolf is nearby. We could start a fire. Probably the best thing to do, like, honestly. Probably is. But he's just howling every two seconds. What's he doing there? He's just chilling out. Alright, is there a bedroll in here? No, there's not. No. Search continues. Snow is coming in now. Uh-oh. Okay, we better get to those trailers. Uh, another firearm cleaning kit. Not a fan of it. That's weird. The peaches spawned. Oh. It, this dog is confused. What is going on right now? I'm going to take one of the big torches here. Go ahead and use that. Oh, shoot. That's not for me, is it? 
Nah, that's for the rabbits. That's gotta be. Yeah, that's for the rabbits. Okay. Um, God, this deer looks so nice. Oh. Don't run him this way. Don't run him this way. You, oh mm, my gosh. That was probably loud in the mic. I apologize, but. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna say screw it. We're gonna, uh, let my good sir there enjoy his meal and we're gonna just head on out. I'm really not liking this snow. So hopefully it doesn't get windy by the time we get to the trailers. It shouldn't in theory, but you never know, right? Um, but I guess something to think about really too is if we want to stop by this river here and grab some cattails, right? Maybe make up for our deer carcass that we lost or passed up, I should say. We didn't really lose it. There's another deer here. That's good. I'm going to go ahead and just try to run the deer maybe to the river. That way, if there is anything, then we'll be okay. Yeah, going to try to keep this torch going. Really saw me from there. Wow. That's, that is that is some... Uh, that's some dead man detection right there. For sure. Alright. What do you have on you? Nothing useful. Eh. Like all the other corpses in this game, usually. Uh, those are deer prints, so... Yeah, that is the... The deer we just scared off. Alright, this area is tricky, to say the least. Very tricky. I don't think there's a moose in town, so... I mean... That minimizes the uh, the risk a little bit. What I'm really worried about is up there. Up there is not a place to be. But we're going to have to go, unfortunately. I think, but before we go ahead and risk our lives, I think we're going to grab some cattails. So in case we do come out of uh, that little choke point alive, we will have some food. All right. Anyone else? Any more cattails? No? Some back here. I'm willing to go back a little bit, but we do have to keep our temperature in mind. I don't want to uh, be out here any more than we have to be. And I want to keep the weather in mind as well. All right. So we're almost at a quarter temperature. So we're going to start pushing for the trailers here in a second. Um, it might be a little bit of a slow process too, getting over to the trailers, but we got to do it and we should do it now. I don't know why I am procrastinating a little bit. You just can't pass up cattails, you know, in dead man, cattails are just everything, you know, absolutely everything. All right, let's head over there now. Um, it does look like it's going to start getting windy fairly soon, so make a move uh birch bark useless to us all right i haven't heard any wolves over here now obviously that doesn't mean they don't exist it just means i have not heard them um so what i like to do usually is throw a rock throw a rock just in the middle just to see if there is anything anything lurking that we can't see. So let's go ahead and do that. Just to throw a rock. This is basically just a bait rock, just to see if we do have anyone in the area. So if there's anyone in the area, they'll be heading over there. Oh, shoot, guys. Oh, shoot. Shoot. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. No, 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 no. Save us. Save us. Save us. No, no, no. We're gonna lose a condition point. We're gonna lose a condition point. Oh, I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. Get in, get in, get in. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Did did we lose a point there? No, we didn't lose a point, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. 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 And we got. Let me just tell you how lucky we just got there. Okay. Here's here's luck number one. There was no wolf there. That's luck number one. Um. Luck number two, we got into this trailer and it's actually warm, all right? And luck number three, <laughs> if we were out there for one second longer than we were, we would have lost a condition point easily. 
Oh my gosh, guys. That's crazy. That is crazy what just ensued. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right. We can't, we can't be that foolish. I, I keep saying it, but I keep making dumb mistakes like that. Can't keep doing that, you know? Go ahead and eat our cattails that we so, so rightfully deserve. Um, I'll go ahead and harvest that right now as well. We'll get some, uh, some temperature back. I want to go ahead and go to the other trailer because that's usually where I like to put up base. A little bit higher, you can see, uh, you can see where everything is. I'm not going to go outside quite yet though. Not yet. Anything we can tear down? 15 minutes there. That might put out our torch though. Ooh, so close. All right. Okay, let's go ahead and step out. Sometimes maybe a wolf can respawn here. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if we have a wolf uh, respawn. All right, just enough. Let's just go. I don't know why I'm messing around for. I always do this, you know. Those reishis did look tempting, but not with uh, not with no temperature, you know. All right, good trailer to be in. Oh, don't put that out. Good trailer to be in. Antibiotics. Hey, there we go. Awesome. So now we can use our reishi, our reishi tea, as a um, warmth buff. So that's awesome. Nothing in there. Probably nothing in here either. Yep. Pretty safe bet on dead man. Nice. Uh, 41 in here. Not bad. Peaches. Um, ooh, 27. Stop with the degrading food. Ugh. It's all so bad. Everything's bad except for our cattails, right? I mean, yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Um, okay. Okay. So I guess we should probably put out the torch. What are we looking at for water? 1.64. That's pretty good. And we're gonna go into the we're gonna go into the dam tomorrow to go ahead and get some more water as well. So we should be fine there. Um yeah. Yeah, that's uh the hunger, right? That's a problem. Let's go ahead and eat. Alright, let's eat that. I'll take a chance. If we get food poisoning, we get food poisoning, right? It is what it is. All right, come on, food poisoning. Please do not make yourself known. All right. All right, that's all I ask, please. Okay, good. Oh, my gosh. All right. That's, that's a success, you know? Lots of things had to go right for us to get where we are right now, and a lot of things did go right, so that's good. Thankful for that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and drop the can. Yeah, we'll drop that. Hey, we got two flares on us as well. Oop, didn't want to take that out. Two flares, that's awesome. That is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and harvest that. Um, in theory, we can read one hour. We have enough time, I'm pretty sure. So let's go ahead and just... No, I didn't want to read that one, though. Um, all right, we'll, we'll, try, we'll try it. We should have enough time on the clock. Yeah, we'll be okay. Okay, great. So we can go ahead and burn that book. Go ahead and burn it. All right. Hey, now would be a good time to get a blizzard so we don't have one tomorrow. Uh, that could be good. All right, let's go ahead and put away three hours. See where that takes us. Awesome. Cool. All right. Three hours remaining on the improved rest. That's uh, That would be good if we could recover condition, huh? Do another three hours. It's been a pretty calm night outside. No, uh, no extreme wind or anything. It's pretty good. All right, so let's just drink through as much water as we can. We're gonna get so much tomorrow that we might as well, uh, or later today, technically, that we might as well just keep uh, keep drinking what we can. Let's put in four. Let's get a little risky with it. Also probably should have put down my pelts, but it is what it is, right? We're alive. Probably do another hour. I don't know. Put them down anyway, right? Do another hour. It, it's really only going to be like a half hour. But Cool. All right. 
Um, awesome. That's pretty rare in Dead Man. All of your needs are filled except for hunger, which is uh, a pretty rare sight. All right, do we have any... We don't have any cured leather, so we can't repair the gloves quite yet. I'm going to still hold on to them, though, for sure. I'm going to still hold on to them. They are pretty good gloves. Um, the mag lens, I really didn't need to take. I don't know why I have it. Um, I'm just going to do a little bit of inventory management here. So the mag lens can definitely go away. Because we already have one on us. Um... Yeah, I don't really know what else um, needs to go. Actually, here's probably a poor place to put it because there's a wolf. Let's go ahead and just transport a lot of this to the dam. Nope. <laughs> there we go. My gosh. All right. Yeah, that, that's probably the better call here. Um, all right. Let's go ahead and head outside. Got to be a little careful. I don't know if like a wolf spawned overnight or something. Something pretty wacky. Doesn't look like we have any company here, though. From when we rolled in last night, it, it did seem pretty tranquil. Alright, so usually I would go for that, but we, we're kind of old. So I'm not going to do any side quests right now. We're just going to stick to the main mission, which is getting inside. So Nice, though. Nice and safe now. Feels good. Is there a deer carcass here somewhere? I don't see any birds, so I'm going to take that as a no. What's the temp out here? Negative 8. Okay. Yeah, it's like what it was for me this morning here on, uh, on my college campus. Super cold. Super, super cold. Alright. I'm going to take it in a little bit. It's awesome. Alright. Uh, the dam should be, yeah, it, it's a notoriously cold place, but it should be pretty warm. Yeah, ju we're just over. Yikes. All right, well, hopefully we can get some food going here. Um, we'll commence the search now. Hopefully we can find some stuff, like I said. Clothing would be good, too. Oh, it just got windy, wow. Yeah, clothing would be awesome. That would be such a privilege to have. But... It is what it is, whatever we find. All right. Nothing in there, and probably not gonna, yeah, not gonna be anything in there. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and dump what we can. So, let's go ahead and drop, let's drop the book that we have to read. That way we know which book we have read already. Yep, there we go. They were both of the same kind, so if you have two in your inventory, you just don't really know which one you read. Um, okay. Cooking pot's gonna stay on us. Both of them are gonna stay, actually. I'm gonna put two of those away and one whetstone. Um, feathers I'm gonna keep. We gotta find one more beard dressing as well. That way we can make, um, a wound dressing with it. Um, books I'm gonna keep on me. Yeah, everything else just kind of seems like something I would want to take, so we'll go ahead and roll with that. I would love a, what's it called? A storm Lantern. Storm Lantern's pretty heavy, but it's pretty good. Definitely one of the better items. Especially when you're, <laughs> you know, recording your gameplay and you want people to actually see what you're doing. Um, storm Lantern is very useful. All right, yeah, it's, t it's gonna be tough to come across loot here, but we will try our best. Nothing in there. Um, sometimes there's clothing in this one, but I'm not sure if that's, yeah, that's not the case here. Right, we do have a locked locker. I would like to assume that lockers that are locked have a better chance of having something good in them, but I don't think that's the case at all. I don't know. Haven't been proven. So. Or maybe it has been, I just don't know. Go ahead and take, yeah, 0.28 is good. We'll take it. Great. Any flares in the sink? That's a classic trick. Classic maneuver that this game likes to pull. Nothing there. Meh. 0.15. I mean, it's water at the end of the day, you know? Anything back here? No. All right. Let's go ahead and head upstairs. We're, we're going to skip a lot of this stuff um, for now. I just want to head upstairs and get the main... Uh, it's not the main loot, but 
It's something that needs to be done. Go ahead and search that out. Great. Um, we'll search this. Search everything. Might as well. All right. Yeah, these desks usually don't have anything good in them. Um, I would say, like, the most top-tier thing you can find is what? Maybe a candy bar? I haven't found anything very noteworthy. Oh, nice. Hey, I mean, that's good. I'll take that. It's calories, so... Thought I saw something there. All right. Let's get to this medical locker over here. Oh, look. Oh, gotta search this. Look at our energy, huh? We literally just woke up and we're already... We're draining like no tomorrow, basically. Um, okay. Open this up. Just gotta check everything for that off chance of finding something. Uh, hey, a bandage. Hey, more antibiotics. All right. That's good. That's really good. Yeah, that's that's a premium item right now, I would, I would say. Definitely, definitely. Ketchup chips. Okay, now we're talking. Now we are talking. Search that. Yeah, nothing going on. Okay. What's in here? Nothing. Predictable. Alright. Take a look at these desks. Nothing. Um, these lockers can sometimes have something in them, but... I've been saying that forever now. Every container could have something in it, you know. But I guess I'm just saying it for hope purposes. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be a brutal scene here. There's not gonna be anything, anything but a big waste of time. But I have found matches up here, though. I have found matches. So hey, maybe uh, maybe we can get lucky. They would be in this desk too, I think. I don't know though, with the loot reroll, it could be anywhere. And it looks like the laptop I used to uh, record these on. All right, let's check these. And then after this, we'll head down to the safe area where the safe is and uh, where the, um, oh, what's it called? The other desk room, the other office. Go ahead and check those. But yeah, it's really, really brutal. The items in this game mode, really brutal. Hardcore dead man, you know? Items are few and far between, including food. Definitely including food. Um, alright, nothing there. Test our luck on these cabinets. Ooh, nice. That's a really, really good find. Awesome. Those are basically... Oh, I did that too. Oh my gosh. This is my new favorite ca filing cabinet in the dam. Wow, that's crazy. I can't believe that just happened. Some real good luck this episode, I gotta say. Some real good luck. Really, uh, really happy to see that. But we, we all know that luck in this game does balance out. So we're gonna have some unlucky moments coming, I'm sure. Um, all right, take a peek. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do... I don't know. I never really do the, the safes, but I just think for curiosity purposes, we might as well. I'm gonna die if I don't figure out what's in that safe, so. And I think... No, we, we did the safe in Trappers, too, so. And I think we did the safe in Milton. In the Credit Union? I could be wrong, though. I could be, definitely be wrong. It would not be um, unusual of me to skip a safe. All right, let's go ahead and sit at this safe for a few hours. Hey, a book. Um, we'll take it, but we'll leave it. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, that's around... I'll stop at 10, but that's around the 15 mark. Maybe 14? Yeah, okay. All right, this is where the tedious work starts here. If I were you in the video, I would skip ahead. Oh, there we go. Actually, never mind. Uh, Tumblr 3, where are you? I'd love it if you could be, like, at 25. That would be great. Come on. It's so tedious. That's why I go quiet. I'm so stressed. Oh, there we go. We got it. 
No, 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 no. Okay, let me let me tell you this right now, all right? When you ever get this, it's just gonna be that. That's when you get this as a first item you found in a safe. That's all it's gonna be. I knew it. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. Brutal, you know. You see why I skip safes, and especially in Dead Man too. Why would you even search a safe? Oh, it's such a big waste of time. But I guess there's always that off chance of a maple syrup, right? So, I don't know. This is what it is. Gotta eat something soon, though. Before we lose the well-fed bonus. Uh, let's see what we do have. Some soda. Can we drink soda? Yeah, we can. Everything else is just horrible condition. What is this stuff? Yikes. I, I don't even want to dig into my cattails. It's such an even number of 20. I just don't want to... I don't want to ruin it. It's, uh... You know, it's survival, though. We're gonna have to soon. Let's see what we can find in this main lobby area, though. Main workshop, rather. Hopefully it's food. I would I would 100% settle for some crackers, you know? Uh, let's go ahead and just leave some of the books we have here. I don't want to walk around too encumbered. Yeah, drop all of those. What are we doing with that? Um, that way we can just walk around more quickly and ultimately just use less calories. That's ultimately the name of the game in Dead Man, at least in, in the early game, right? So. Oh, boy. So, and while I'm going through the grand scheme of things, um, a maple sapling, right? That's going to be something we want to... Hey, accelerate. That's going to be something we want to find sooner rather than later, right? I'm pretty sure in the ravine there's a chance for a spawn, but I don't know. We're going to be heading through the ravine next. So we'll have to keep our eye out. I know there's going to be birch saplings everywhere. There usually is. Um, it's just with the, uh, you know, the maple is the big ticket item there. There's a container over there I saw spawn in. We'll have to go check that out. Uh, doesn't... Oh, nice, a flare. Hey. All right. Well, yeah, I don't know. You know, it's, it's weird when I get excited for flares, but it's really good to have, you know? Super good. We're honestly probably going to be using the flares going through Crumbling Highway, too. I'm honestly probably just going to light a flare right before we go in and light a flare as we're leaving. <laughs> that region is just so vicious. It's so vicious. Brutal. That's what makes it fun, though. I thought that was a lantern. All right, down to the lower dam. Again, hopefully for some food. Um, We'll take that, but I'm going to leave it. We're not making arrows yet. Sounds like a blizzard outside, too. Good time for one. Definitely. Uh, heading here. Nothing going on there. Anything going on on you? Doesn't see... Yeah, there's nothing. Cool. Alright, come on, food. Where are you at? Uh, that's a whetstone. Not quite food, but I'll take it. All right. Come on. Ugh, I'm gonna have to dig into my cattails. I know I am. That's all right. We got him for a reason, right? Oh, nice. Ragged scarf. I'll take that any day. Awesome. Yeah, it, it honestly might be worth to um, just sit down and do some repairs on all of our clothing. That could probably help us in places like the dam where it's, you know, just above freezing. Um, it could be a lifesaver. Definitely could be a lifesaver. Um, I'll, I'll even circle back to the point I made going back to um, when we were literally about to lose point of condition before we ducked into the trailer. If we ducked into the trailer and it was 32 degrees, we would have been, you know, screwed. We would have lost a few points. But if we had repaired our clothing, we would have been fine. You know what I mean? It's just, it's a, it's a game of degrees, really. A game of degrees. One degree matters so much, especially in Dead Man. There's no room for error. But anyway, anyway, anyway. Um, usually here there can be a heavy hammer. I think I found one before. Not sure though. Yeah, we're gonna want to eat soon. I wish I could see what would give me food poisoning and what wouldn't. <laughs> I want to eat it all, but I can't. 
you know? The condition's too low. It's too low to eat safely, basically. Alright, oh, that's good. Can we get 100% torch? No, we can't. Ugh. Unfortunate. There's no famous red scarf here, either. If you've been playing the Long Dark prior to this DLC update, you've known that there's always been a red scarf there. Always, always. And if there wasn't, there was something wrong. <laughs> it's like an icon. Iconic scarf. Oh well. Those days are over. No backpack here either. Interesting. Okay, let's take a peek. See what's in here. There can be good stuff in here sometimes. Not gonna lie. Hey, quality tools. Okay, that's even better than our simple tools, so... I think we're gonna... Dump both of them, though. I'll take it. We're gonna dump both of them in the, in the front locker. Alright. Hey, there's the backpack. Alright. It doesn't matter, though. Nothing in it. That's fine. Uh, alright. Come on, food. I'm very impressed, though, in the amount of teas we have. We've got quite a few herbal teas and quite a few coffees as well. Yeah, look at that. That's amazing. We have, what, 9, 13 coffees right here? That's awesome. Super good. Very happy about that. Alright, final room here. Um, we'll head back to the main area, the main little lobby entrance once we uh, loot all of this. It's going to be pretty quick because usually there's uh, nothing to loot. Hey, a lockbox. All right. That was in our Tales from the Far Territory run. When we got into the dam, we saw that. Hey, beef jerky. Okay. Awesome. I'm going to go ahead and eat that right now, actually, I think. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and eat that. Um, could get risky and eat that as well, but I'm not gonna. We're not near a bed right now. Awesome. A little reflection there. Oh, it's that thing. Interesting. Well, I guess that's how you know it's windy outside. Besides, you know, just straight up hearing it. Um, okay. And nothing there. Alright. Um, oh, there is a sewing kit back here. 76. We'll just take it anyway. It's fine. We'll just bring it back. Cool. Alright, well, that's the dam. Um, it took the better part of a, of a morning, but not a long time if you do it efficiently like we did. Um, so, yeah. We'll head back to the main lobby. We'll put everything away. Um, I'm probably gonna head back outside and go to the trailers. Um, just because it's warmer there. What did I see in here? Nothing. Alright. I'm tripping out a little bit, <laughs> but like I said, it's warmer. I think it's like 41 degrees in there compared to 33 in here. So just naturally, we're going to want to take the warmer spot. Um, I think, I think there's a workbench in there, So we can actually go ahead and take the simple and quality tools over there if we want to, but I guess there's really no point because there's literally a workbench in here too. So they'll just be doing nothing. But we'll we'll stick to the original plan here. That'd be a good place to tuck something. Alright, let's head back out of the, the uh I think it's what lower dam? Yeah, it is. Alright. Leave that. Yeah guys, I mean anything compared to this whole run, I feel like the pressure is on now more than ever. Um, and that's that's a little bit of a bold claim considering we literally spawned in a blizzard. Um, but the food situation is going to become real very soon. You know what I mean? This food is not going to cut it. 27, 24, 26, 31. That's not, that ain't going to do it for us, unfortunately. Um, we're going to have to, you know, start hunting very soon. Which is going to imply uh, taking all the rabbits we can find and taking all the deer carcasses we can find as well. So... Um, yeah, it's going to be a bit of a grind. I guess it's pretty, pretty argue. It can be like a pretty argued thing that now the pressure's on more than ever, but I guess in general, the pressure's just always on in this game mode. There's never a dull moment, you know? So. Oh boy. I'm still shocked from that. From that, uh, oh, what's it called? Oh, we didn't pick that up. Still shocked from when we almost lost a point there. Oh, I would have cried. Would have cried, but you know, we're good. We're good. 
Um, five reclaimed. I'm going to keep on us. Nice. We do have a bandage. We didn't have one before, which was kind of concerning. So I'm glad we have one now. Look at that clothing deterioration. 90. That's down 7% from when we crafted that. That's crazy. That is crazy. Yeah, we're going to want to repair that too. For sure. Um, and we're going to want to repair that as well. Which we can't yet. So. All right. Let's go ahead and do some inventory management. We're going to want to put the books away, for sure. That Those are going. We'll keep two on us. That's a pretty fair amount. Um, Frontier Shooting Guide, no thank you. We'll keep the 10-hour books. I'm really inclined just to drop both of them. Reason being, they're, you know, 10 hours. So, yeah, I don't know. Let's just drop them. I'm not going to read 10-hour books. That's just kind of ridiculous. Same with the quality tools. Not going to need them yet. Extra sewing kit. Extra whetstone. We're going to find more along the way. And yeah. Let's go ahead and just eat a little bit. Yeah, because this is risky. I really don't want to eat anything. <laughs> let's go ahead and eat the tomato soup. It's in the 30s still. So let's just eat it before it degrades any faster. Or any more. Okay, great. That was a, that was a little risky, but that's fine. Uh, put that back. Hand opener's amazing. Just an amazing item, you know? Gotta love it. Um, okay. I'm gonna put that away. It seems a little weird, but we're gonna repair our scarf right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Come on, repair chance. You can do it. Nice. All right. And that's gonna be 1.7. So we'll go ahead and put that on. Now, it's gonna be about the same as the head wrap but it's got better waterproof protection i'm pretty sure so that's fine i'm happy with that give ourselves a little more cloth okay so we're gaining again we were we were losing during that little uh little repair but we're good now um so let's go ahead see what else needs some repairing that could use a repair definitely um that could also use a repair so let's go ahead and do that now Oh, awesome. Let's go. Cool. All right, so we're still up 11 degrees, but we're up 2 degrees from freezing, so that's always good. Drink a little of that. So, in terms of inventory, we're looking pretty good. We are looking pretty good. Um, let's see. It's midday. Midday. Um, to start a fire or not to start a fire, right? That would be the big question here. And I think we're going to want to start a fire, you know? I think we're going to want to start one. Obviously outside, but once this wind calms down, for sure. Um, I'll even just go ahead and take a peek, see what we're dealing with. Yikes, that's just not fun for anyone, is it? Cool. All right. Well, tell you what. Go ahead. Um, I don't want to eat any of that. I'm not going to eat. I'm going to make a vow not to eat these three until we have, you know, a safe area to do it in. Okay. Um, it's either read or repair. I think we're going to do some repairing. We're going to continue our our uh, theme here. Um, ragged sports vest. I usually don't repair stuff like that, but since it's all we're finding, might as well just repair it. Um, all right, well. You know, point one of a degree is something, right? Go ahead and repair that. We're probably going to fail since we repaired all the other ones. Oh, no. Wow. Eat my words immediately. That's awesome. Cool. All right. Well, we're still rocking 34 degrees, but at least we're a little bit warmer. Um, nothing really to do right now but to wait, so I think we're going to read an hour. Can't sleep because we have no bedroll. All right. Sounds like the wind did calm down, so let's go ahead and take a peek. See what we're dealing with. Oh, nice. Okay. So the wind is from that way, so we can go ahead and start a fire here if we want to, or over here somewhere. Um, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, but we are coming up to time here, so I think I'm going to end it. It's a good spot to end off, really. We'll go ahead and head in for a save, but yeah, we're in a really good spot. Um, just to recap, you know, we'll head into Ravine next episode, see what we can do. But before that, we'll go ahead and start a fire outside, right outside the dam here, and we'll see what we can do there. 
Um, so yeah, if you made it this far, thanks so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I hope to see you all in the next episode.